welcome back to Life is Aisha and today I'm doing another segment of Sneaks and Deals which is a segment that I brought to my channel like a couple months ago and I honestly have been because they're consistent with it just because I haven't really been buying anything but it serves as a way to get your sneaker cops for the low. I was meaning to do this video like right after I picked these shoes up that way it will still be available to you all but um it's always a if I have any links or anything to share with anyone, I will let you all know. So this is going to be for all the under retail gang that likes to get your shoes for cheap. Um, I thought I did a pretty good job this um, the past couple of months. I have three pair that I'm going to share with you all in this video. Um, they're going to be Nike, Adidas, and Vans. So let's just get right into it. The first pair, which I already posted on social media. So if you follow me, then you've already seen these. But each year, Nike does their annual friends and family and it's like 30 percent off um at their nike clearance stores and also at their nike stores so um i went to my local nike clearance store and i got the nike air max tailwinds and these are how they look the only con about purchasing from the nike clearance store is that none of the boxes have the top on it these are super cute to me um and i hate to refer to shoes as like oh those are cute because it just comes off like super girly but um i mean i'm a girl so yeah but i just when i saw the show i was like oh my god i want those i had seen a pair of these before online and I have been wanting a pair of this model for a long time I just had yet to buy one and also um this is not the original color that I wanted I wanted the one the pair that was black white and neon and I have yet to purchase those yet but sooner or later more than likely I will have them this was dubbed the China Rose pair so it kind of has hints of pink in it it has um like this mint green this aqua kind of color it kind of fades into it and then it fades into this bright neon color at the top of it and it has the little nike check right there on the toe box of the shoe the shoe is basically made of all leather all around here and right here in the center part this is more like a mesh feel but it's one of those like it's not like a cheap kind of mesh it's really pretty well made and it's kind of thick like on your standard air max um if you own any other air max or particularly air max plus or um air max 95s um they pretty much all are made very similar with the exception of a couple details like this detailing right here of course it's another nike check at the heel of the shoe and also right there on the back of the shoe and those are both in black and they're outlined in neon green when you turn the shoe around to the back you have air max just on the back of the shoe right there and also on the inside is pretty much all black these came with white laces as you can see um that was the only color it came with on the sole of the shoe it's just basically black um you have a couple hints of pink and neon um inside the air bubbles of the shoe you do have the same aqua blue color believe that the camera is picking it up I did get these in a size six youth and um boys so that's pretty much my size a six youth is equivalent to like an eight or a seven seven and a half in women and it's typically the size that i wear on all my sneakers some i go up to a six half some i um go down to a five and a half it just really depends on the shoe and the model of the shoe these are a pair of adidas and i did order these off of adidas.com they may still be available on there um if not they i know they are available on a whole lot of other websites and these are a pair of the adidas eqt gazelles and these are in women um i got these in the size eight in women which i really feel like i probably should have went to a seven and a half just because um for me personally adidas does run kind of like a half size bigger in certain models and this is my first pair of the eqt so i'm not really sure but of course um trial and error so it's just your standard adidas box and then you open it up a regular adidas paper nothing too too special about that so i'm going to pull out the left shoe right now it has like a little you know tag with the sizing and everything on it so um this is how the shoe looks it's a silver um like a pale pink color and also it has this gold and it's kind of like metallic where you see the three stripes that's so the three stripes that you have here you also have the three stripes here which is you know adidas all the way this shoe is made of a pretty much all mesh the tongue of it is mesh and what i do like about the tongue i'm not sure if it's going to pick up on camera but it does move 
So um, it may say Adidas one direction in the other direction. It'll say equipment, which is what EQT stands for. The gold stripes right here, it kind of has like an elastic feel to it. So I think that's super cool. On the inside of the shoe, it's just the same teal color. And it also has Adidas in pale pink on it. It's more like a baby pink or like a bubblegum pink. And also on the sole of the shoe, you have the exact same pink and some black detailing here. And the inside of it is white. So, um, yeah, a super cute, stylish shoe. The back of the shoe, you just have Adidas, and you have the Adidas symbol there. This right here is like a little tab. Um, I always say in all my sneaker videos, I do like that because it makes pulling the shoe on and off pretty simple and easy to do. The shoes I will be showing to y'all are a pair of Vans. Before I get into this pair, I did purchase these from ASOS, and if you're familiar with it, it's a UK-based website. And I have ordered quite a bit of shoes off of there in the past. Um, they have a wide array of different brands that they offer. And I always tend to find a promo code, which I used one when I purchased these. So I was all happy about my purchase. It wasn't a pair that I just necessarily needed. I just looked at the shoe and I was like, those are super cute. So basically, I got sent the wrong size, long story short. Um, for whatever reason, I thought I was purchasing a size 8 in women. But um, I got sent a size 8 in men, which is a totally wrong size for me. It's equivalent to a size 9.5 in women. So you can definitely understand my frustration with it i've already set up to get the, have these returned um, i'm gonna drop them off in my local ups but it still didn't stop me because i wanted to share them on today's video with you all so you can see what i have in my hands and what i was potentially buying i have a size six and a half um in men and also a seven available so either one of those i think i would be comfortable with just because vans are a slightly narrow shoe and they're more flat footed so i can go slightly up a size in them and they still will fit comfortably and not too big on my foot so without further ado this is the pair here they um are a multicolored pair of shoes it's canvas suede and some leather um, materials that we use on this shoe it does come with an extra set of blue laces but the laces that come with it though these are so different and cute to me now i don't know if i would wear these laces in the shoe or if i would put one white lace in one shoe and keep the blue and um white design lace here um, this is burgundy then it has pink here on the back of the shoe it has this vanish color and this is my favorite part of the shoe i just think this and the burgundy really adds a fall effect to the shoe it tones it down it doesn't make it look super springy or summery so um i definitely when i get my right size i will be wearing these more than likely probably before um the winter season is over definitely um in spring though but um, you can probably see that the shoe does look slightly bigger. It's not that noticeable on camera to me, but in person, I'm like, this. Shoe, when I pulled the shoe out the box, I knew off top that it was too big for me. And it's just like a gum. So this, these are her most Vans are. The last thing I do want to show you is that I do like the new Vans box. I don't know if this is just super new, but I haven't purchased Vans in probably... I know over six months how the top of the box opens i think that is very neat um and it's kind of new to the box or it also could be that these are men vans and i typically buy women's and kids vans so i'm not quite sure on that let me know down below if this is how the new bo vans box is or has this been a box that's been around and i'm just late to the wave <laughs> but that's going to just sum up this video um i hope that you all enjoyed it I will be bringing you all more steals as I am able to grab them myself. I always try to, if I see a good deal or something, try to share it on my Instagram, um, on my stories, so I can share the wealth, so to speak, with everyone. And we can all save a coin together. So as always, remember to like, comment, subscribe, and share. And I will see you in my next video. Thank you for watching. Mm -hmm.